Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And just yesterday, I made a video about recreating this logo for somebody. And he's wanting it to on an arch. And because we played with it, it's not a text anymore. You can't use text to path. And in this situation, you really can't use, if you have, I think it's 19 and above, there's actually object to path. But it really doesn't work in this scenario. So what I would suggest, my logo is 0.3 inches tall. I'm gonna change my nudge factor to 0.3. I'm gonna take my line and I'm gonna make a duplicate. I'm gonna nudge it up 0.3. Then I'm gonna bring my logo in and try to get it on that bottom line. Let's zoom in here a little bit. Then I'm gonna grab the envelope tool I'm gonna take away that node, and I'm gonna take away that node. Don't really need them. Our other two nodes are pretty close. I'm gonna grab both these nodes, and holding down the control button, you'll get straight down. Just bear with me. Grab both these nodes, holding down the control button. Now you've gotta let go, and you can only do one node at a time, but you can bring that word right up to that other line. Now there's always gonna be maybe a little bit distortion, but you can uh, actually change every individual letter. Like as you can see, the C is a little bit taller, not on the line, so we can go up to object, group, ungroup, change our nudge distance to 0 .001, grab that Well, okay, it is ungrouped. There we go, just like that C. And just nudge that C down to that line. Always remember, you can always hit the shift key. Our O's are a little bit off. So let's select our O's and get them kind of on that bottom line. Our T's a little bit off. Anyway, once you take the arches away, it looks pretty good. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.